Yeah, man, it's going down. It's Donnie Houston Podcast. I am Donnie Houston. Check it out, man. We are uh, live right here now, man, um, at White Oak Music Hall in Houston, Texas, man, for the Texas Smoke Break concert. And right here next to me, man, I got one of the performers, man, all the way from San Antonio, putting it down, 7098. What's going down, bro? Man, I can't call it, bro. Chilling, chilling. I'm happy to be here. I'm blessed, man. Yeah, yeah, It's a yeah. blessing. You ready? So so what we what, what, what we, uh, what we expecting tonight, man? A show. You know what I mean? Like, I just, like, I was just telling you, like, I just I want to have a good time with my music, you know what I mean? Like I, when I say that, it don't really it's not really like so much like it's not so much like the good time that people my age are into. I just want to have a good time, you know what I'm saying? I want everybody to have a good time, and I feel like uh, that's that's what I'm coming to do today, you know what I mean? Like it's just gonna be like it's gonna be a vibe. That's my that's if I feel like if there was a category for my music, I think that's where I would put it, yeah. just a vibe, because I come with so many different things, you know what I mean? But it's still in pocket of what I feel like encompasses a vibe, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, you talk about a vibe. I mean, everybody on the show tonight is a vibe, man. Talk oh yeah, about just Facts. being in the, in the company of of such dope artists. You know yeah, I mean? we got Devin man. Dude, we got Slim, we got Larry June, we got Liz, we got you know what I'm saying. Like, I was such a fan earlier, standing up here watching Devin the Dude do his mic check, cause his like he was flowing and he started singing and he did a DJ cut with his mouth. I'm like, bro, like <laughs> this is such like I'm extremely humble being here, bro. Like I just feel like I uh. I, this is this is like a super blessing, you know what I mean? Like these are people like timeless artists. They make timeless music. Like you know, you can go down anybody on the list. It's all timeless, you know. And I'm just I'm blessed to even be considered to be a part of that, you know what I mean? So yeah, now nah, you're 100 percent right though. Yeah. Facts, yeah. yeah. So uh, what do, what do you have coming up, man? Musically, man. Uh, I just I actually finished the EP, and I'm down here in Houston. I've been staying here working on the EP, and in the midst of that, uh, I'm working on a lot of different records, trying out a lot a lot of different sounds and stuff like that, but. My uh, my first EP, Break From The City, I dropped that last year. So I'm planning on dropping two this year. I got one called Where I Belong and the second one I don't have a title for yet. We don't have a date on Where I Belong yet, but it's done. You know what I mean? We're just like kind of, you know, getting everything on the back end work with, you know? Yeah, yeah. And trying to see how we gonna, you know, angle everything and stuff like I learned a lot being here in a month, you know what I mean? So it's a lot of different things I have to draw back on and kind of like, you know, go back to the drawing board because I want to like, you know, it's time for that, you know what I mean? So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, talk about uh, just coming from San Antonio, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, uh, representing for the for San Antonio, bro. Like, you know, it's that, crazy. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. It's a crazy feeling because I um I never was considered to uh, I guess more or less have a sound that resembled anything like like with the music coming out of San Antonio. But the fact that uh, I might get I, I could be the one to be the one to do that. You know what I'm saying? To be the one to put put on for San Antonio and stuff like that, it's never really, it wasn't really a task I was I like I look for, but I I embrace it because I feel like there's a lot of kids like me, like you know I bring up a lot of different artists when I talk about that type of stuff, but like growing up with Drake being one of my favorite artists, like seeing a simple dude like that put on for such a big place, it's like bro I could if I ever whatever I do with my life I want to be able to do that for San Antonio, and this is a blessing to be able to do it with this you know God given talent, bro like. And there's a lot of kids down there that don't know who they are and don't know that they can do that. I I just pray I get to be the one to do that. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a blessing, bro. Like, yeah, you know. Yeah, man. Before we get up out of here, man. Uh, for anybody who's never heard your music, man, uh, tell them uh, what they can expect. You know what I'm saying? What what uh what your uh, vibe is like? What you bring into the game? And you then can also where to find you. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, social media. All my social media handles. So social media handles are official 7098. And uh, like when you listen to my music, bro, honestly, I think you're just going to hear truth. You're going to hear a lot of like I say the fears that I feel like a lot of people don't want to say in their real life. You know, what I mean, I bring that into my music because I was told early on when I was right, like, don't talk so much about your life. You know, what I mean, try to do like try to make people live vicariously. But I learned like, bro, like. The people that I started living vicariously through were talking about their life. You know what I mean? So, and there's a lot a of things. Yeah, you know what I mean? And that's what I couldn't shy away from that because there's a lot of kids, like, there's a lot of people like me in the world that can hear my music and be like, damn, like, I was going through that. I would not want to talk about that shit. You know what I'm saying? But I feel them 100%. You know what I mean? And I just, like, it's really just a lot of truth. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of, like, a, I, I'm very experimental. Cause I, when I really when I started music, I wanted to sing. Well, I first first started, and that wasn't the vibe for me. But it yeah. wasn't the vibe in the far as like you couldn't sing or it, I it can sing, but um, I'm not a singer, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like I just You're not I don't fear singer, right? Yeah, right. yeah. You know what I mean? But I can get in that pocket. But I just I, I I want my music to flow everywhere it can. You know what I'm saying? 
So yeah, so anybody that listens to that, bro, that's I just I just want you to sit back and listen and enjoy the ride. You know what I mean? So yeah, already right, that's what it is, man. Well, I appreciate you stopping through, man. Definitely, Looking forward man. to catching you on stage, yeah. Huh? You yeah, for saying? sure, man. I right. appreciate you, bro. Thank you, my man. Seventy ninety.